to another vlog. Um, today we're going to be looking at outerwear for uh, for winter. Um, today I have three key pieces that um, I feel are investment pieces and that can um, last you not just this season but for many years to come. So the first piece we're going to look at um, today is a biker leather jacket. Um, you can get biker leather jackets from vintage stores, second hand or um, you can go to places like All Saints or you can maybe go for more premium brands um, like Saint Laurent or Balenciaga which is what this one is. Um, I bought this uh, quite some time ago when Nicolas Gesquia was the creative director. It was something I desperately wanted and I saved up to buy it um, and it was such a moment when I did finally get it because I really really wanted it. Um, and I swore I would treasure it forever and wear it with as many items as I could. And I think I actually have done that. Um, it's something I can wear, say with a pair of tracksuit bottoms, to wearing it with an evening dress or, you know, to work over your outerwear. It's quite a cool item um, to have in your um, collection or your wardrobe. Um, so it just does go with everything and I think it's something that's quite timeless and that isn't really going to go out of style anytime soon. And as I said again, you can wear it with lots of things that they're versatile. So I would say this is one of my key investment pieces for autumn winter. The next piece um, we're going to look at is a classic trench coat. This particular one is from Burberry and I bought this years ago. I bought it in the Burberry outlet um, and we're probably talking about 10, 15 years ago, probably more likely 15 years ago. I've worn it so much and again, it goes with everything. And, you know, as we live in London, the rainy city, we really do need a Mac or a trench coat in the wardrobe. But it's a perfect weight for, um, you know, an autumn day or even in spring um, again it goes with everything I wear it from anything from jeans to you know work with something more smart or even over an evening dress uh, you know if if it's sort of you know not poking at the end um, if it's a, a cocktail length one I find this coat again very versatile and something that I know I'm gonna have for many many years to come um, I think if you look after these items, you will have them for many years to come. Um, I just kind of look at my mum who's had one for probably 20, 30 years. Yeah, probably more like 30 years. And it's still in fabulous condition and she still wears it and it still looks as relevant as it did when she bought it as it does today. Um, the next piece, um, is a you know a very warm wool and alpaca coat this particular one is the teddy bear max mara coat um i did again i really 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 wanted this piece but it when i bought it i was sort of like oh my god what have i done but i can tell you it was worth the money it's super lightweight and it's so warm um and yeah you just want like a teddy bear in this it's so snuggly i love it and you know being that we have such cold winters here it's my best friend i have to say it's absolutely my best friend and again i don't think this thing is going to go out of style anytime soon um you know it's been around for quite a while and i don't see it going anywhere anytime soon so you don't have to buy something designer like i said in the very beginning you know you can source these pieces from a vintage store or you can buy pre-loved from places like Bestiaire, eBay. I mean, obviously be a little careful if you are buying these designer pieces, but you don't have to buy a designer piece. You can buy something from Marks and Spencers. They do very good quality um, coats. They make really nice wool coats and I actually have one from them, um, which I've had for a long time. Um, or you can get a biker jacket from somewhere like All Saints or even Zara. A Mac, I think, or trench coat, you would definitely find in a vintage store somewhere. 
Um, so, you know, you don't have to go for the obvious brands, but I think if you're looking to invest in some great outerwear for autumn, winter, that you know is gonna last you for many years to come, not just for this season. These are my three key items that I would suggest buying. Thanks again, guys, for watching this vlog. If you like it, please like and subscribe to my channel. Um, thank you again, and I hope to see you very soon. Take care for now. Bye.